one thing I don't like about feet forward cruisers. Let's go for a ride. You are watching Cycle Cruises all on one motorcycle channel. Subscribe today. As you guys know, I recently purchased a Ducati X Diablo S. And this has V4 controls also, but you can change these two mid controls if you want to. However, I like the feet forward controls. I really do, it's really comfortable. But the main drawback that I see with them, for me personally, who is a defensive minded rider, is that I don't have that feeling that I can like jump off of my bike to a divert trouble. I've seen it done before, man. You can launch yourself over just on your pegs right here. Jump off this it's like it's a diving board, man. Like I told you guys in that past video I did where I talked about, you know, jumping off of launching off yourself off of your bike, like to avoid getting nailed by a car. You know, with the feet forward uh, setup here, you can't really do that, man because there's nothing to jump up off of you know i like to pit your your feet are forward so you can't really stand up and jump off your bike so i i don't like that feeling with it otherwise i love it because i i love being laid back and just chilling and having all this power on tap it's amazing but like i said a car comes or something and you like last minute and you can't divert from the trouble like as far as move your motorcycle out of the way and uh being able to you know if i'm on my sport bike where i can possibly jump off the pegs i can't really do that on this bike the only way i i think i what i could do probably is maybe put my feet up on the seat but it you know something you know if a car comes at you it happens so fast like it's literally a split second to be able to make that move and i don't think you can really do that with the feet forward setup like i don't think i could get my feet like up on this seat to like jump off and bail from the bike the only thing i can think of is if you like low side the bike to avoid you know getting nailed by a car but there's really nothing else i don't know maybe you can put your feet on the engine covers there and launch off if you can i don't know <laughs> I, like i said for me i like to ride out in the country anyhow and that's why I, one reason why i got a cruiser where i could just sit back chill enjoy the ride out in the country and enjoy the scenery i just pointed that out i don't know what do you guys think i know a lot of you guys don't like the feet forward design and some of you do some of you don't a lot of you guys convert get the mid uh peg kit for this bike so you can put the controls mid midway but i'm keeping that stock like this feet forward i like i said i love the feet forward design for comfort and like you're just in chill mode it's like i'm up in like i'm sitting up in an easy chair right now <laughs> even though i stay defensive minded but like i said just not being able to jump off i don't know guys what do you what's your thoughts leave a comment in the, in the uh, comment below and let's talk about it you know that's why i create these motor vlogs to incite community discussion but otherwise you know like i said this bike is just so comfortable and just so enjoyable and has the power of a super bike power look at that <laughs> oh man but yet in a nice cruiser package and lightweight for a cruiser and i love this bike how it has the lighted controls here that's really awesome man it has and the, look at the screen it's just super visible amazing oh man i could throw this in cruise control and ride from here clear across to california guys the wind doesn't bother me i know you know some of you guys complain with a naked bike the wind blasts but i don't it doesn't affect me and i'm out in 30 degree weather today man i was on the highway that this bike is really really nice on the highway i don't feel wind there's no wind issues here at all for me i don't have any issues with me man it's not an issue i don't know some people just like to uh whine 
I guess. I don't know, man. A lot of sensitive riders out there. Like to complain. Chronic complainers. I don't know. Whatever, guys. But, uh, hey, if you want to get my motorcycle gear, my helmet, my gloves, all that, camo pants, boots, this awesome winter jacket that's keeping me warm out here in this cold weather, I include links in the description and comment section of this video. Or go to my website at cyclecruiser.com and click on the menu tab, My Gear, and those are links to all of my gear. And if you want to see more of my videos, click on the menu tab, My Videos. And all my videos are categorized in the various playlists there it's to make it easier for you to navigate through. I have over a thousand videos. Hopefully you can find something that will inform you, entertain you. Hey, hit thumbs up if you like this video. Share this video with your friends. I want to hear some more feedback, but I hit thumbs up. It really helps me to get motivated to do more videos. And uh, it really helps my channel. I appreciate all you guys. Hey, hit the subscribe button. The Psycho Cruiser's got all three venues now, baby. Sport Bike, Cruiser World, and Dual Sport World. All three awesomeness. So until next time, I'll catch you guys later. Deuces. Hey, don't forget to check out my other YouTube channel that features the original Bug Out Moto van that is designed and built by yours truly so that I can live in my van with my motorcycle. So hey, check me out at youtube.com forward slash Bug Out Moto. Subscribe today.